Jill and I'm going to show you how to design something in Over, upload it to Printful, and then send it to Etsy since this seems to be a very common uh, question that people just starting out with Print On Demand have. Um, so here we go. I've opened up Over. If you go web.over.app, that's where you can access this. Uh, we're going to start a new file, so new project. We're going to change the dimensions to 5,000 by 5,000. That seems to be a good size. That's 5,000 pixels by 5,000 pixels for canvas size. And you want the transparent background. And then we're going to show it at a 10% height. So let's design a um, Christmas, just something Christmas. We're going to have something that says Merry Christmas. Just simple. So graphics you can search for Christmas. Christmas watercolor. Enter. And look at all these choices. Oh boy. This one looks good. So we're going to have a little bird. You can resize it. And then we go to text, or actually let's have it have a little ornament in its mouth. So it's bringing you a little Christmas ornament. There we go. Then we're going to go over to the left and click text. Text, since we can't see it, the little, uh, it popped up right here, but we can't see it. The size is too small. So let's up it to 300 just so we can see it. And then we'll go down to color. And um, since we've got black and yellow, let's just make it black. So in the color selection, let's match this black. Click that. That changes the text color. And then over here, we'll go back up to text. Select this and we'll have it say Merry Christmas. With an exclamation point because we want them to have a very Merry Christmas indeed. Um, and then you can select whatever um, whatever font you like. Um, since this is just kind of cute Christmas, let's leave it at that. And then you can resize it, click outside of it, make it bigger, and there we go. Merry Christmas. And I feel like it needs something else. There we go, a little bow, a couple little bows. No, that looks crummy. Um, uh, let's see. There, that's more like it. Merry Christmas. So it's not very Christmassy colors, but that's okay because this is just an example. And then we're going to export it. Christmas bird. You want to export it as the PNG because you want that clear background. And then we're going to go to Printful. When you get to your Printful, you're going to go to your product templates, which is right here product templates. And uh, if you're brand new, you're not going to have anything showing up in these. So click on new template. Women's or men's, we're just going to do a t-shirt. So just select whatever you want. I like the Gildan 64,000 because there's a great profit margin there. And since we have black writing, we're not going to choose a black t-shirt. Um, let's just go with white. And then click on the design tab choose the file and we're going to upload. You should find your file here, your little Christmas bird PNG. Wait for it to upload. <clears throat> and then, et voila, there it is. <clears throat> so you can choose it. And position it. I like to put it a little bit higher on the chest, not like right up in the neck, 
but um, you know, pretty high on the chest. You can make it as big as you want. I like to make it pretty big so that it shows up nicely in the thumbnails. And then um, click continue. And when you save the product template title, that's just for your records. So we're going to do Christmas bird. Now just scroll down to add sizes, select all sizes, or if you don't want to do the 2XL and 3XL, just deselect, put whatever sizes you want. Save product template, and then it's going to show up in your product template menu. Click this little box here and then add to store. And hopefully you've already linked Etsy to Printful. I have eBay and Etsy hooked up. So you'll once again have the choice to select more colors. I like to do one color per listing, but that's a personal choice. Proceed to mock-ups. Here's where you choose what you want on your front page. I like to have um, somebody wearing the t-shirt um, as a second option. So let's start with the flat mock-up. Um, that'll be the first thing people see. And then you put it on people. So let's do people with faces. Um, and then you can choose whichever other ones you want. These show the designs really well. Um, and the smiling faces are good. So let's, let's have some smiley people. And in the mockups, you're going to want to have them as JPEGs. You don't want the PNGs because um, there's just no need for that kind of file size. Proceed to details. Here's where you're going to have the menu where you can enter everything that you want for um, your Etsy SEO. So product title, title, we're going to do Christmas t-shirt, Christmas shirt, Christmas bird, Merry Christmas, Merry, um, we'll do shirt for women, shirt for men. There are lots of videos. Um, I recommend Life Hacker Couple who show you what, how to research uh, your SEO, uh, shirt for women, shirt for men, holiday shirt, um, Christmas, let's do gift for mom, and then to do your description doesn't really matter. I like to copy my product title with commas. It only works with commas, not dashes. And then go down to tags. You definitely want to add your tags. And you just paste that in, and everything that um, is between commas, they'll group together for you in tags. So we'll do, you can have up to 13 tags. So let's do Christmas gift idea, Christmas gift, holiday gift. Christmas outfit. Okay, that seems good enough. You usually want to fill up the 13, but I'm just going to save this as a draft. I'm not going to be actually selling this. And then click proceed to pricing. And here's where um, you set your profits. And um, yeah, that looks good. $8.05 profit. <clears throat> $16 is reasonable. So yeah, we'll submit that to store. So you want to give it a minute to add the product to your store. Just give it a minute and then we'll go to Etsy. And we'll go to listings. And uh, let's refresh because we're going to wait for it to have for it to show up in drafts. There we go. Draft one. So click on draft. And here is where you're going to optimize your listing. So thumbnail, that looks good. Um, your photos, this is all your photos. I always include the size guide. Um, listing details, you can change your SEO here. About this listing, this is important. If you're doing print on demand, you can't say that you made it. You have to say another company or person. And it is a finished product, made to order, category t-shirts, yep. Size, I offer more than one. Yep, we took care of that. Primary color, uh, yes, secondary color, 
uh, let's do yellow. Occasion, you can, if, if you're making something for an occasion, here are your choices. Holiday, it's Christmas, so let's click Christmas. Sleeve length, it's short sleeve. Neckline, it's a crew neck. Um, your description, you can change that if you want. Your production partners, you have to say which production partner. So if you're using Printful, Printify, Guten, uh, any of any of those. Section of your store, Christmas and holiday. If you don't have sections, that's fine. Tags, I have one left, so let's add another tag. Um, let's see. Christmas ornament. There we go. Since the bird was carrying ornament. So inventory and pricing. Uh, well, this is stuff that we all took care of in um, Printful. So all of this should show up. Your sizes, your prices, quantity, just you don't have to change any of that. We're not personalizing it, so leave that alone. Uh, Printful automatically will um, populate the, the shipping. Uh, you can edit it if you want. If you want to, to say that it's going to take longer than two to seven business days, which over the Christmas season it will most likely take longer to two to seven days. So in that case, you just click edit. Um, so two to 10 business days and then save profile. So there it shows up two to two to 10 business days. It's always better to over promise and under deliver. No, under promise <laughs> and over deliver. Let's get that right. Um, do you want uh, to run this on your Etsy ads campaign? Um, no, we're not going to do that. And then if we were to publish it, you just click publish and voila, it would be posted on your Etsy. Um, let's see if we can preview it. Yeah, yeah. Listing details. What did I do wrong? Another company. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yada, yada. Did I not? Oh, I didn't click printful. There we go. Preview. There we go. It's all saved, ready to go. So there, you do that, you're you're good to go. You are good.